Because already we are doing four count, yeah. three count, in which yeah. we are representing six. Yeah. Uh, but then I was like, oh, okay, let's do eight count. Later I asked myself, what is the meaning of eight count? Because eight count is still four. Yeah. So with the lesson five, we are going to do what? Go back and play four count. Yeah. But then we're going to play eight count. And what is the meaning of four? Or what is the meaning of eight? It's the same thing. I'm going to play the same, the same. Ta -ta -ta. <laughs> See, we have it as average, yeah. As yeah, so anything that we are going to add, that person boost, boost, boost is still there, yeah. okay. All right, six, let's say. I'm going to add one note into the normal eight we are playing. Yeah. Because sometimes you hear musicians talk about six and eight. Yeah. In which a lot of students and beginners will go confused about uh, what, what, what are we talking about? This six and eight beat, you know, like jazz musicians and top yeah. musicians use it six and eight, six and eight. There is nothing different in six and eight and four count or anything it is just addition yeah or subtraction so i'm going back to the eight and i'll make it there One note. Yeah. So if I'm playing one, two, three, four, it is the same thing. Oh yeah. Yeah, because that was the same two notes. I added the quick. Yeah. And eight. Okay. All right. Six. 